Hi, this is Scotty Scott, pastor of Gospel Way Church in Irvington, Alabama, and I want to talk to you today about my experience of coming to know God and be a Christian. I was raised in a Christian home. My dad was a pastor, and at a young age, I come to know the Lord. But you know, I came to know him at a young age, but I didn't serve him all the time. There was a time in my life when I walked away from God, I walked away from the church, I walked away from my beliefs. I still believed in God, but you know, if you believe in something, you should try to live what you believe. Well, there was a time in my life that I chose a different path. And I'll never forget that as I was following that different path, that God sent somebody my way. They came to me, they ministered to me, and they reintroduced me back to God. And ever since then, I've been serving the Lord, and He helps me each and every day of my life. So I want to talk to you. Where are you at in your journey? Maybe you're watching this, and you don't even believe in God. Maybe you're watching this, you don't know what you believe. Maybe you believe in God, but you've been through such a struggle and such a hard time that you're having a hard time serving God. I want to tell you something. Greater is he that is in you than he that is in the world. When you become a Christian, you have a power inside of you that's greater than any power on this earth. You're a game changer. You have greatness inside of you. When you come to know God, you're the head and not the tail. But there's one place where we get blocked all the time, and it's in our mind. I don't care how great you are. If you can't open up your mind to receive and release the greatness God put in you, you're going to walk in mediocrity your whole life. You're going to walk and not have your inheritance. You're going to walk and not have your power. You're going to not have the anointing. But guess what? Those are all big church words. You're not going to be happy. Everybody wants to be happy. If you want to be happy, I'm going to tell you what you do. You come to know the Lord as your Savior. You give your life to God. And you say, well, I've already done that and I'm still not happy. Will you obey God? Because obedience unlocks the greatness of God. You obey God in, in your living. You obey God in your giving. You obey God in how you treat people. I've seen people go to church and be so holy and read their Bible and always have a testimony on them, but be mean to everybody around them. Well, the Bible says that if you're a Christian, that the world will know you're a Christian by your love one for another. So I encourage you today to open up your mind to God to receive the greatness he's invested inside of you. If you don't know him as your savior, repent of your sins. Ask him to come into your heart. Make him the Lord and savior of your life. And guess what? When you ask him to come in your heart, you're starting on a journey that's going to not just change your life, but it's going to change your eternity. My name's Scotty Scott, and these are just a few thoughts from my mind today. I pastor Gospel Way Church in Irvington, Alabama. I invite you to come be a part of our growing, exciting church. Great things are happening. Every Sunday, man, the room's filling up. New people coming in. People getting saved. People getting delivered. We're excited about that. And I'd like for you to be a part of it. It's in Irvington, Alabama. My name's Scotty Scott. I'm the pastor. You can find me on Facebook. You can email me, Scotty Scott, B-O-C-M, at hotmail.com. I'll pray for you. I'll get in touch with you. If this has been a blessing, share this with your friends, and I'll be coming to you again. This is Scotty Scott saying you're a game changer, and have a great day.